So, do you want me to use Ragnarok for this fight? No. Oh no. Okay. This guy is pretty easy on his own. You just gotta watch out for his aim for it, for his range attack. Okay. It doesn't hurt that much to even to begin with. Ah. Yeah, again, this is phase one of the fight, I want to point out. Yeah. This is the easy part. Right. Once phase two kicks in, he'll only really gain one more attack. But my god. Mm, yeah, that you talk this much. That attack is going to be the end of everyone. Because mm. it's going to be a familiar Final Fantasy attack. From All right, you know? Yeah. I mean, it's uh, Cloud's final smash for Pete's sake. Yep. That's definitely a lot more of a room clearer, that attack. Mm. Oh, gosh. I forget what that's called. An attack you avoid, the end. <laughs> yeah. Okay, I want to advise this to you. Once the fight starts, immediately use your shot lock. Yeah. I'm, pr I'm just gonna... Yeah, I'm proud about what you're about to what's going to happen is going to insta-kill you. <laughs> You don't have your stuff like second chance. Yeah. Who is the soldier, by the way? Those who play the PSP a lot more. Well, no, we'll know this guy. It's Zach. I'm saying from uh, Crest Core. Hey, stop it! The match is over. I never played Crest Core. I heard it's good though. He Wait, what now? Final sure. Fantasy VII Crest Core. Oh, mm. I heard it's pretty good. But that's one of those things they really need to, to do, like, a console remake. I mean, why not? They're already doing the Final Fantasy VII thing. I, I know nothing about Final Fantasy VII Crisis Core. All I know or... is that it's basically the, the, game, the, the prequel. Oh, okay. So that's how, like, Bob became the, the emo boy he is. Hmm. And how he, and in fact, actually, the Buster Sword is Zax, I believe. Is Zack actually from like a uh, Hercules movie or cartoon? Not at all. He's a he's a he's Final he, Fantasy. Oh, okay. Set my heart free. Ugh. Yeah, I was gonna say because like. Here we go again. All right. Again. Shot lock him the mo the moment ain't hold that hold that R1 button down. Okay. No. That this no. my friend is the Omni Slash. I'm surprised you you survived that. All right. That yeah. That was the Omni Slash. If he if he catches you with that, you're in trouble. That and, he, and he starts with this fight, with attack. Hmm. It, 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 we're making it look easier than it is. You can dodge the Omni Slash, but it, but you have to really work for it, work on it. Yeah. You doing it again? Right. Ah! Ouch! All right. Ugh. There we go. Damn. Yeah, Daddy, that was scary, right? Uh, you got caught right in it, and did you see how much damage he was dealing to you? Well, yeah, but <laughs> I still managed to do a uh, cure, but... But I think that's because you had, um... You're, you're, that's because you had Leaf Bracer. Yeah, like, I had second chance and all that, so... Wait, so you had once more. Yeah. Second one? Well, one of the two. Once more, we'll protect you from while you're in the lane. We'll, we'll keep you from dying in a combo. Mm. Like if you're gonna constantly get him back and forth, back and forth, you won't die. Mm. But like, like if you're at one HP, then like, then you get hit, slammed into a combo, then you're not surviving. What second chance does is, it, assuming like you got hit by one powerful strike, that's not in that, and you'll you'll barely survive it. Right. Well, I didn't. It wasn't as bad as I thought it was gonna be. Like you just kind of have to be careful with that attack. Yeah, cause you, you cause it's so sudden. Mm. Is it playing Zach theme right now? Hmm. 
Is uh, is it playing Zaxxon right now? Not the way you look. Uh. Or is it still like not even playing music? Cause I can't hear anything. I I I can't really hear it that that well. So. It's like a dun 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 kind of thing. It's like a, mm. it's like it's like a, it's like a whole, it's like a Pokemon Gen three song. With trumpet. Mm. <laughs> Also, I like how there's like an audi audience cheers and stuff when there's no one there. To be it's fair, they're probably like watching from an invisible spectator stand. Then again, like, cause, cause imagine, come on, on the flash. It's too bad. Well, I mean, uh, there, there's probably people supposed that's that are supposed to be watching, but uh, uh, hardware limitations and all that, I guess. Uh -huh. Yeah. And by the way, people, we're really not missing much right now. Oh, Zach, yes. And you got the Mark of a hero. It's not gonna do well for your magic, but it is a good keyboard to use in here. Hmm. Is it least... gonna be? S yep. Yeah, that world's really short. Not much to talk about. Yeah, yeah it, it's just really a tournament, as it was in Kingdom Hearts One. Really, it's just more story-driven, I guess. Yeah. Okay, let's go quick. Let's go quick Keyblade. Mhm. Mm oh, we have another. Put stop like... in there. Yeah. That's what you got from meeting Zack. And also we got Zack's D-Link. Mm-hmm. <clears throat> Zack's D-Link. Alright. Yeah, uh, what was I doing again? Uh... You're, you're, you're putting, uh, you're putting on the mark of a hero. Alright, uh... Oh, wow. <laughs> don't... <laughs> One of magic. Hey, don't worry, it'll be fine. Yeah. I guess. When you with Zach, with Zach, you basically get a lot more um, attack and physical attacks. So basically, stuff that would e easily make Terra go into his um, his critical impact if he was using if he wasn't doing that. Oh, okay. With one emblem, you get Berserk, which increases your odds of, of which doubles your odds of getting critical hit. And with two, you get Attack Deflector, which gives you a fifty percent chance of negating all non-elemental damage. Oh, okay. With the first one, you get some kind of really powerful strike. Maybe, like you know, like that, that ground impact attack he does during the fight. Yeah. That's the first. One. Yeah. If you get two of them, it's called Hero's Entrance. If you get the second one, you get Hero's Pride, which is Omni Slash. Nice. I want that. <laughs> oh, oh yeah. This is like really kind of like random because I. You you only. You this guy's like the only time. Can. Is this like the only time you do something like this? Well, you do fight these kind of heartless swarms, or heartless, unversed swarms before. Like, you'll, you'll, see, you'll do it later in, um, you know, what's it called, uh, Neverland, I think. How do I go up? You don't. You're, you're high enough to hit them. You, you, they'll just they'll come low. Oh, okay, so I just... It's... I mean, it's not too bad, but it's a little bit random. It's not pointless, actually. I don't think you can get any experience. Yeah, because like the thing's not popping up. It's it just. Yeah, well, you get some money. There's a bit too. There's a bit too many of these guys. <laughs> oh, okay. Never mind. I don't even have to kill everyone. At least you get some more HP. Yeah, it's true. Right. True. Hang on. What? Yeah. I will. I will, Dad. File that recording. Ah. Uh. I'm gonna have to let the cutscene go on while I make fun of the eat. Okay. Anyways, I like and I don't like this world. Huh? Mm. What? Yeah, I'm probably yeah, I'm just saying, like mostly for the boss, but yeah. Well, as Terra, you hate this one. Yeah. I like, I... I like this boss as I like the boss here as Aqua. I don't remember really remember the bosses with the other two. Um with Ventus it's this giant um in jellyfish ring as Aqua, you have to like um the, the Disney in the Disney quote unquote villain here. Ah, oh, right. I, okay. I'm not saying the name yet just because. <laughs> I also like this little picture here. Yeah. Welcome to Alilo and Stitch World Deep Space. Yep. Alright. Yes, Grand Council. I've confined him until we can determine what he is. <laughs> Take 
cover. Leave it to me to handle these fiends. Whatever you are, you're under arrest. Eventually. <laughs> oh, I love Gantu. Alright, now I have another swarm. Yeah, but, um, I guess since Jason's not here right now, I guess, um, to talk a little bit about, like, the, uh, area we're in, like, it was it? Sorry, I'm oh, are you back? I, I, I'm sorry, I'm still, I'm still too much food, but... Hmm? I, I have to in my grave. Okay, Anyways, but, um... Anyways, um, yeah. I think there's a new enemy here, too. Yeah. Um, if I'm, I'll, I'll bring it up when I see it. Right. And once my pop up, once my pad comes up. Hmm. More ready rumble though, so. Yeah. But yeah, like um, you you. There it is. You don't go to like uh Hawaii or anything, but yeah, like I, Lilo and Stitch was like a massive part of my childhood. Like I, I love loved that movie. the. Yeah, I, the mu movie, both of the movies was uh, were great. Yeah, uh, I the Leo and Stitch series overall is actually pretty good. Yeah, I, I, I that's a, again that's a massive part of my childhood. Like I loved the show, like growing yeah, up. Yeah, I remember. the Leo and Stitch series, the movie, even both, both of them, all, even all the movies are actually pretty good for what they are. Yeah, even like Leroy and Stitch is yeah. probably one of the. It's probably the weakest one, easily, but I still like it. Easily the weakest. Oh, by the way, yeah, those, but, uh, yeah by the way, those satellite distance are called Sonic Blasters. Mm -hmm. The 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 inverse that was like satellite dishes. Right. I got the jumbo chukiba. I am jumbo chukiba. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, but yeah, like um, uh, before I went went to school uh, for most days, like, I just like woke up and watched like. Yeah, because like early movies. morning at around six for me, it was and there was always at least one airing of this before I had to go to school. Yeah, it was like. I I usually watched either this or Lil uh, what was it uh, Recess and no, those were some really good times because both of those cartoons really bring back a lot of memories. Yeah. Uh, I got my food. All right. Because he's so powerful. Exactly. Everyone always gets handy and fancy when somebody more powerful is in the neighborhood. Do you understand? Uh -huh. You know, randomly, a thing I want to point out is like seeing um Terra with the keyboard there. Yeah. It reminds me of like whenever I like to play a Kingdom Hearts game, I like to sometimes do a run where I don't use any different weapon. Because mm. like the cutscenes feel a lot more natural seeing Terra with the keyblade. Yeah. Wearing glasses I wonder if we'll actually. I wonder if, if we'll actually go to Hawaii or something in Kingdom Hearts Three. That would be cool. Yeah. There's, a, there's quite a few stuff in here actually. Hmm. Speaking of like uh, just Lilo and Stitch and Recess earlier, I wonder if, if uh, a actual Recess world would actually work. I doubt I, it. What would they? What would you do in that world? Yeah, that's what I'm thinking as well. Like, I don't know how that would really work. Yeah. I mean, Air Dash is your best friend in this room, by the way. Yeah, they could, they could probably just something could probably work out, but uh, I don't know. Oh, high jump! They got... Ooh. Well, not yet. <laughs> oh. <laughs> Wait, what? It just clip it. Replace. Uh... I think it was a normal jump. All right. Yay! Now we can jump higher, like a little, like a little trolley bird. <laughs> All right. W w whimsical, whimsical on um, Terra. <laughs> Wait, come on, go down. Well, there's a couple. Uh, normally, I would just jump to the ones that are into any platform that you can reach to. Hmm. Like, like yeah. Like, not the ones that just go up. Because this room is pretty big. Yeah, that's true. Well, true. well vertically, anyway, it's pretty big. Uh, can I even I, go I up there? Yeah. Let's see, um, let's run the room. Um, you can probably, um, wait, get to that platform on the right. Below you on the right. 
There. Well, this one? Yeah, the one that has the glass in front of it. Alright, uh... Must have tried to get that puzzle piece. Yep! Yeah! And it's empty. <laughs> Insert a sound effect here, in the editing. <laughs> well, I think my impersonation was good. <laughs> Fine, take yourself yeah. with it. <laughs> ah, okay. Yeah, but the, air, the, the, the flying dash goes pretty far. In the, not, not, not even the flying dash, the air dash. Yeah. Alright, that's that. Mega Ether. I think there's a Bandara in here. Oh, nice. Oh, Ooh, it, I, I was expect. I was expecting it to be uh, for that treasure chest, uh, actually, because it's like, oh, we just mentioned it, so well, yeah, well, now we're gonna get well, it. Well, brutal blast, that actually, we're gonna aim. That can help us make one of the one of the Terra's exclusive attacks. Oh, da, 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 da. oh, nice. Um, I'm trying to remember what it is. I think we can make G. I think with Geo Impact, we can make something. We can make something called Quake. Hmm. No, not that. Let me see. Let me look at the list. Yeah, we, well, yeah, we can use, we can make a quake with that. Hmm. Is there anything else? Here? There should be. A you couple said more. there was like Fundara or something. There might be a Fundara in here. I might be remembering wrong. Okay. Well, Hold on I that don't. Hmm. Is there any more treasures? Another fun thing about Terra is that one of the, he has an exclusive ability to himself called a Warp. Hmm. What warp does? It's basically an instant kill. Oh wow! If it works, if it does work though, it um you won't gain any experience from it, unfortunately. Hmm. You still get your drops uh -huh. though. All right. I'm trying to figure out what we can make with that brutal blast. Besides, oh yeah, no, if we we can make um brutal blast and zero gaviga. We can make meteor. Hmm. But actually, the thing with meteor is um. Unless we're using Geo Impact and Quake together, it's gonna be. It, it, there's a 10% chance that. It, there's only a 10% chance it'll work. Right, I got you. So, so, yeah, a thing we should mention with melding is that sometimes there is a percentage. I think that's the cell that you were in. <sighs> Alright, come on. I want. I'm gonna get some Fundara, Fundara please. Well, hit the camera and make sure there's any more closed doors. Yeah, but, oh, no. What am I doing? Oh, oh, over there, no. over there, over there. Oh, that one? Yeah, what about that one? Uh... If, 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 if there's nothing in it, you might as well open it up so you know you've been there. Yeah, that's true. Mini mini bite! Yeah. Yeah, there's nothing here. Yeah, you might as well open it up, though. Oh, I thought the uh, the bed was a treasure chest for a sec. <laughs> it's done. Wait, get, it's at a higher. Wait, what are over there? Oh, there's one. Oh, oh, oh. And nice. nothing. Dang it! That's a troll thing. The terror really hates that wall. <laughs> I think that's it actually. Uh, I, I I I I'm pretty sure you got. Oh, when you're done with this, you'll get thunder. You'll get the thunderbolt aim thing. Hmm. Yeah, I didn't. Really I, see think, any I think other... that's it. Let's get out of here. Yeah. Let me again. Check this, but. Yeah, freeze the window. That's Jumbo's cell. <laughs> yeah. It's, it's kind of easy to get lost in this world when you're in the other one. When you have the other characters. Yeah. I remember getting lost a little bit. Especially as Aqua. Hmm. <laughs> the visit here is short as his Terra, so. so. Yeah. Alright. Check in that system storage. <laughs> Alright. I think that's the yeah. map over there. Should be. They usually. Well, they're always big chests. And you have to dramatically hit the. Hit it to make it open. Except when it's a fake one. Hmm. Yeah.